gonna say now I was gonna about to explain okay. because he brought okay. up the okay. topic so that you you believe that the Quran says that uh, Allah cannot enter his creation absolutely okay. can you show me can you show me the ayah where it says that pardon I want to know the ayah from you according to you you said Allah cannot enter his creation can you show me the ayah please yeah. It says in the Quran. Which chapter and which eye number, please? That nothing, that nothing resembles him. Resemble. No, you said creation. you said clearly, and everyone was listening, that Allah cannot enter His creation. Where in the Quran yeah. does that say? Where does it say that Allah cannot enter His creation? Where you get that from? Yeah, it's a big difference between nothing in creation is being resembling Allah. Yeah. yeah. Allah yeah. entering into creation. No, no, because you know Muslims have always claimed Allah cannot enter his creation okay fine can you show us from the Quran where it says Allah does not enter his creation and that's my question to the Muslim guests here if you don't mind please give me the ayah number and the chapter number hmm. I'm waiting if uh, if you don't mind please provide the evidence from the Quran I mean if one actually reads okay, from cover to cover you know okay, there's 114 chapters yeah firstly okay okay if once okay I mean we as as Muslims okay once again okay and and I'm gonna point this from a Muslim, from an from a Muslim okay belief point Bro, bro, I understand. Um, I didn't ask for a complete speech or your yes, own explanation. Okay. I'm asking you for a chapter number from the Quran and an ayah number so I can read it together with you because we can put it here in the chat and maybe everyone can benefit from it. So I'm asking you clear evidence from the Quran where it says Allah cannot enter his creation. You're the Muslim. You may the claim. So yes, please yeah, firstly, um, okay, answer. Actual, well, firstly, the actual question okay, is not based upon logic. Okay, and and the actual Quran is based upon logic. Okay, okay, that's okay then. One. Okay, I understand. But please okay. answer the question. Give me the ayah from the Quran where it clearly says Allah cannot enter His creation. I'm waiting because you make a claim. That means you need to back it up. If I make a claim, I need to provide it from my yes, Christian. Okay, then there were many claims. Okay, you know, I mean. Okay, so you, you're you basically me. basically what you're trying to say is you Muslims make claims, but you cannot back back it up from your own firstly, holy book. Look, okay, first of okay, before you, okay, I mean, you recently joined. Okay, the, the actual conversation. Yeah, I was listening. Right, okay, remember, were, right? I was listening for yeah, five yeah, minutes. There were many. Well, if, if you were listening, there were many questions that I asked, which were not answered at all. Such as okay. No, no. We will uh, listen. Okay. Listen. I, yeah, I we do, we will answer all the question. No problem. But I'm yes. asking you a very very important question. You claimed that Allah cannot enter the creation, and I asked you. You said yes. Allah cannot enter uh, enter his creation. So I'm asking you, very humble. Please provide the evidence. Back up your claim because you Muslims for the last 1400 years have claimed. Allah does not enter his creation. So I'm asking you, as a Christian, to a Muslim guest, to our server, you are very respectful guest, and from your words, I can hear that you are very respectful, and I like that. So I'm trying to be respectful back, but you make a claim, please show me from your Quran where it says Allah does not enter his creation. I'm waiting. And I've asked the same question already five times. Can you, mm. me, can you maybe ask Prophet Google, peace be upon him, to help you? <laughs> Pardon? Ask Prophet Google, peace be upon him. Maybe he can help. I mean, I mean, is that it may, may, meant to be some, some, some joke or something? Well, wait, yes. wait, 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 wait. Maybe you can, maybe you can help. Maybe, maybe you can get help from your yeah. friends. Ask your friends then. Relax. 
Please relax. Yeah, you know we are we, we are relaxed. Relax. No, no, we are relaxed. We well, are very okay, relaxed. Because, but no, because you're trying to do something here. No, no, no. Like I'm not doing. Asked, no, no, no. no, no, no. You, you made a claim. Question. Listen, you made no, a guys, claim. Guys, just no, guys, no, let, just let a talk, second. Please. I, I, I let me talk. I will let, let you talk. I will let you talk. You made a claim. I'm I'm humbly asking your a question, and I'm asking. Give me the ayah. Why can't you give me the ayah? Because this first, is, okay, the question is illogical. something that you may ask, okay, does not make sense. Why? It's okay. How? Wait, how does, it, how, do, how does it not make what sense if you make a claim no, and no, you no, no, make a claim purpose? and I asked what you for evidence? Give me the evidence. Look, okay, well, I came onto your server, okay, there were many claims that were made on here. You know, the first claim you made, okay, is... Jesus died for the sin of mankind. I, d I didn't make that claim. I'm well, asked. I I was listening. Well, your brother made. Uh, okay. Your brother made that we, claim. We can we can okay. provide evidence. No problem. Asked, and then when I said, does this apply to everyone? Then you, you said no. Okay. I, but then first Jesus, of all, I didn't okay, say anything. They, I was what are you listening. Talking about? Listen, I no was listening. I was listening in the background for five minutes. Okay, to understand what's going on. here. I've listened to many uh, questions. It's okay. And I think our friends here provided the evidence from the Bible. We can back it up with sources. You, yeah. uh, every question that you have about the Bible, we have verses for it. We can give it to you. I'm asking a very easy, clear question. I asked you, everyone was listening. Can, can Allah answer. enter his creation? You said and I gave you the no. Answer. Okay, you gave me the answer. Now I'm asking you, Back up your answer. You said clearly everyone was yes, listening. Okay. And Give, me Give me the ayah. No, Give me the ayah. Give me the ayah. Calm down. Okay. I am very my calm. Evidence. I'm calmness my itself. Evidence, my screaming. evidence. Look, my evidence. Because so you raised your voice, okay? I did they, they not raise my voice. Okay. All right. Okay, but you know, okay. can you can you can you give me the my ayah? Evidence. Look, my evidence. Can you give me the my ayah? Evidence. Yeah, and I'm and I'm providing you my evidence. Okay. I I am I'm already waiting for five minutes, my friend. Come on, man. Let him talk. Let him talk. Okay, look. Okay, look. Okay, we'll leave you. This look, this is okay. Uh, in terms first of, of all, first of all, I'm not your. According to Islam, I'm not considered your akhi. According to the Quran, I am najis. Uh, you cannot even uh, uh, call me akhi because how can you call someone who is najis who is who is the worst of creatures, because Jews and Christians, according to the Quran, we are the worst of creatures. How can you call me Akhi, which means brother, while at the same time your Quran calls me Najis, which means unclean, filthy, dirty, and at the same time I am called worst of creatures. How are you going to call me <coughs> Akhi? <laughs> okay, that's a valid point. Okay, so, okay, thank you. Thank you for your honesty. <coughs> so, I'm, I'm still waiting. For right. the ayah. Now, me, Rob, me, yes. and my evidence is the question Rob. itself is illogical. Why? Okay. And according to you or according to the Quran? According to you or according to the Quran? Quran only that answers things which are Please. logical. Okay. Okay, give me the give back it up with an ayah, please, man. No, for, yeah, he just for the love of God. Rob. I just answered it. No, no, but I'm asking. Okay. No, no, he didn't. He didn't. I ask him. I'm asking him to back up his claim. Buy an ayah. Is that so hard for a Muslim to provide no, one you ayah? Well, I gave you the answer. I said the question is illogical and the Quran only answers Why? How? logical questions. If it wasn't, so if, if it wasn't logi logical, you should not have said it's impossible for Allah to enter his creation. So when you're going to make that claim, you need to back it up from your Quran. Right? Because Right, it is yeah. mentioned. You're, you're, you're I mean, Nema, what I'm trying, what I'm trying to say no, is, you're, you're everyone can make a claim. Listen, everyone, no, no, wait, wait, wait. Claims. Now listen, no, no, listen to the answer now. You keep saying, oh, I've said ten times, I said this and that. E yeah, because really everyone simple. can make a claim. Everyone can make a claim, but. Back it up, my friend. I can say I'm Superman. I can say I'm Superman. How? Where is my backup for that? Do you understand my question? So please, you as a Muslim, to back it up. Okay, give me the eye. I'm waiting. The answer is very, very simple, right? You're making a big deal out of nothing. Yes, because we are talking about the Quran. We are talking about the Allah. We know. <clears throat> what right. was the point, mate? The way we know that, you know, about saying what was the that point, God mate? can enter into 
Well, he has no point. Yeah, what he, was the he, point? Listen, listen, like I said, I can say I'm Superman. I can, I, I'm, I can make the claim I'm Spider Man. <laughs> yeah, the speak, but but back up what, with an eye. Uh, I'm still waiting for point? seven minutes by what? now. My point what? is, what? back it up. Back up your what claim. What point is? Can you repeat yourself, mate? Well, uh, we're still waiting. Right, right, let me so let me moderate of, this a bit. This Everyone, quiet, Allah quiet, 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 in the Quran, please quiet. In Jesus is the prophet of God. Please. Be quiet, no. please. Listen to me, I moderate. Now, the, uh, Abu, even if you are moderate, it doesn't actually... Well, shh, quiet, quiet. You, Abu, you asked the question. Or, get, let me re-ask the question. Is uh, you, Did you make the claim that Allah cannot enter his creation? Is he limited? You know, he, he cannot be contained, cannot enter creation. Did you make this claim? No, the claim that I made okay, is God cannot be compared to his uh, uh, actual creation. So you're saying the, same the claim. Quran doesn't explicitly say that the, that Allah it cannot enter creation? creation. Well, yeah, then, well Quran, if one Quran now reads the Quran, one and voice, goes, one and voice. If, can, can, I, can I talk, please? Go ahead. Okay, I because I'm being I'm being cut off. Okay, and I don't like the fact that I'm being cut off here. You know, I, I, I was there for some time. Okay, and each time when someone spoke, I was quiet. Take your time. This is your time. You get thirty seconds. Thank you. Okay, I mentioned. I said because okay, the, the purpose. Okay, that I, from the beginning until now, me and my other brother. Okay, with a brevity here, we said. God cannot be compared to his creation in any shape or form or manner, okay? The Christians believe that God, okay, he came in the form of a man and then he died, you know, okay, and then he came back again, okay? You're done? We have two different, okay, you know, who... Right. Stop calling us, Akhi, stop calling us, Akhi. You're still giving the source. Doesn't the matter the source. Christian. Doesn't matter the Christian belief. We're talking about uh, your claim that you just made, yeah. that you just said you didn't make, but you did. Allah cannot enter creation. And are you saying that the Quran doesn't say it, but it's just your interpretation over the verse? It's There's not my like... interpretation, okay, because God clearly says that he cannot okay, be... Okay, then show it. Compared. Show it from the ayah. Show well, me one well, ayah. What does it clearly don't, say? Don't, don't talk. Okay, be, be, be quiet. Okay. What does it clearly say? It says, okay, Allah okay, clearly says in the Quran okay, that he cannot be compared to his creation. Okay. We, okay. Is there no, anything let me, else? Let, let me speak. Apart let me speak. from this. No, no, no. I gave you thirty <laughs> seconds already. Now, please, short answers. Is there anything else apart from this ayah that backs no, up your claim? No, that's, that's one of many ayahs. Okay, so give me. Okay, give us another. Give. Okay. The other ayah. Okay. The, once again, Allah mentions that okay, He mentions His attributes. For example, His attributes Lord of. of mercy. Of, of of creating uh, it unique to him dude uh, this is not back it up your claim you're not in a good position do you I have an, something more or not? i am otherwise we'll just claim. move on okay if... I, look i gave my answers whether you accept my answer or not okay that that's that, that's for you right. uh -huh. your answer is not sufficient because it's not clearly stated but it's your opinion Okay. Now let's... My opinion, can okay, I can I talk now? Yes, yeah, sure, sure, Rob. Go, go on. on. Okay. Let me respond, me right. Allah Azza wa Jal exists with our is pay. The prof is a prophet with <laughs> Okay. Rob. So okay, here's the thing, guys. I asked the same question, I think six times, seven times maybe, Probably and I'm more. still yeah, and I'm still waiting for ten minutes now for him to give me one ayah to support his claim that Allah does not enter his creation two we have two maybe three muslims okay. now on this server on the voice chat all three of them cannot give us one ayah to no, support their claim i've not been allowed to speak right after you after rob you go okay right. so i'm I've still waiting, waiting I, i'm still waiting right, for okay. you to give me the ayah where it says allah does not enter his creation i'm waiting all right now uh, baravi please take your 30 seconds right. provide evidence Right, okay, so it's very simple. It's, you know, it's no need to get emotional about this. It's very simple. Okay. You're saying you want proof. That yeah, that one ayah. About, right, so you want proof that it's, you know, 
that those who believe because about the belief that if Allah enters the creation, then this isn't, you know, this isn't possible. Now, the fact that I understand, Allah I understand that's no, your okay. explanation. Me give me, yeah. I, I'm, I'm letting him skip. Let I don't, me. don't give he me got speech. The he don't give question. me. He doesn't need to, Angelo, bro. He doesn't need to give us a speech. We're asking for either you're going to say we don't have the ayah, and we can move on to another topic. The, I, I'm going to tell you what the ayahs are. Okay, let me give speak. it. Don't give me speech, please. Right. <laughs> Those verses that talk about Jesus, about the Christians being disbelievers. Forget about Jesus. Forget about Jesus. God. We're talking about Allah of the Quran. You said you Muslims made the claim Allah does not enter his creation. Everyone heard you, yeah, and everyone heard why me. Why do we say that? Should I tell you why we say that? Should I tell right. you why? You no, no, why? no. I you want an ayah. I want an ayah that back up your claim. Uh, Rob, Give me the ayah. He got okay. the question. He understood. The let, let, are, don't take too the long. Ayahs, right. It's, it's not long. It's literally going to be less than a minute. Go. Right. The answer is all those ayahs. It's not just one ayah. All those verses. Okay, give all me. Those ayahs, give me. No, listen, listen. You're, you're not letting me finish my sentence. You're just going on and on. I is don't want the speech. I don't want the speech. I want evidence. All right, don't for, the, for the <laughs> sake of peace listen. and quiet, just let listen. him speak once and then we move. Is he going to let me speak? Go yeah, ahead. Go just say, to be fair, you do need to provide reference, not just say all of the verses. Give us like one. This is embarrassing. Right. Yeah. Go no, ahead. it's not embarrassing. It is yeah? because you cannot provide evidence that backups your claim. He, he's searching. He's searching. <laughs> ask, ask Prophet Google, peace be upon him. Please let We're him help. Gonna you. See it or ask your sheikh. Now, right? Let him ask his sheikh. Maybe he can help. Well, I found it, by the way. Okay. okay. Right. That's, if finally, I'm finally. finally. Okay. Okay. okay, give us. Right. Okay, I mean, you wanted an ayah. Okay, and I found an ayah. Okay, is in Ali. Uh, okay, is in chapter one hundred and twelve. Okay, Can someone post the verses, it? Can someone in the verses, it? I'll post it. Yeah. Okay. One hundred twelve. And, and it clearly says one hundred twelve and ayah number, please. Ayah number, please. Ayah number three. It says he begets not, nor was he begotted. Okay. In that, okay, we we, we clearly understand. Okay. okay the, okay. No, let, 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 now let me explain. In that, okay, we understand that Allah does not enter his actual creation. Where does it say it? He clearly he begets not. Okay, I mean, so, I, 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 so. unless you don't understand what the Where, word begets okay, not don't okay, mean. Okay, what does that mean? It means he, he does not get a son or, or a daughter. Yeah, that right? means, yes, yeah. Okay. And, how, and, how, and how would one have a son then? Maybe wouldn't, wouldn't a person okay. need to enter so a Allah, Allah is somewhere, right? He is not in his creation, according to you, right? Yes. Okay. Uh, so, so place. imagine, imagine, uh, as this ayah says, he does not have a son, and he does not he have he a daughter. No. Okay. He he great. Okay. Well, great. I'll, I'll, I'll actually post it. Uh, okay. Okay. Saying... Okay. Can I can I talk now, please? Okay. So, I understand. So I understand. Talk. No, no. You have talked, and we gave. I think not brother really. Angelo. No, no, not really. no, brother Angelo gave He's not really you. Giving me a chance to talk. Angel, brother Angel gave you time to answer my question. Wasn't it no. right? Everyone was witness no, of it. Bar Bar Barely, Barely, I just, uh, I just uh, said take your time and give I mean, some. Well, uh, some well, both the answer that I gave a sufficient answer, yes or no? No. 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 Why not? Right. Because. because it doesn't say anything about Allah not being able to enter. It just says that Allah cannot beget something. Yes, okay, but you have to poor. understand, okay, how does one... Please don't call us Akhi. We are, we are the worst of creatures. We are just Don't matter, talk us. Yeah, Rob. but I don't like, I don't like him to to go against his Allah, right? Yeah, well, yeah, well, don't call it, well, don't, don't come Akhi and say, oh, go to Prophet Google then. Well, well, because okay, you know, clearly you, you, I am you saying it. I am re, saying re that you need that. to understand why. No, no, it's not, it has nothing to do with respect. I am saying it because clearly you cannot back up your claim. No, Abu, just, just please, please, please carry I gave, on. I gave an please evidence. Carry it's on embarrassing. Abu, please carry on with your explanation. Why do you think this proves? Okay, the reason why this proves my point. Okay, in the. 
context of that verse, it clearly states he begets not, nor was he begotted. Yes. What has okay, that meaning? Okay. He, first of okay, all, Allah wasn't, okay, meaning he doesn't have a father. That's number one. Okay. Number two, okay. 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 okay number two, okay, when he says he begets not, okay. Yeah. Okay. It clearly means that okay, he does not come onto his creation. No, no, it doesn't. No, okay. no, no. What? Where does yeah, it say? Well, it? well, either well, uh, it's not my fault then. Okay, if 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 you can't uh, understand. Uh, what? Abu, you're reading into the uh, text. Uh, uh, it doesn't say it. Be honest. It man, doesn't it's... say it. It's your interpretation, which is a very forceful. Yeah. You are, he's a, guys, okay, okay. We gave you a chance to answer the question. You cannot. He now, guys, look what is happening here. He gave me an ayah from chapter one hundred twelve, ayah three. It says he neither begets nor is he born. Okay, we understand that. It. It's clear. We understand that Allah, according to the Quran, he doesn't beget. He do, uh, no daughter, no son. Okay, fine. But you clearly said Allah does not enter his creation. We're asking you to provide evidence that supports your claim. This uh, ayah, uh, wait, let me speak. Uh, let, me, let me speak. I am asking you to back up your claim where it clearly says Allah does not enter his creation according to the Quran. We are asking not for two, not for three, not for four, not for ten ayahs. We are asking for one ayah where it clearly says Allah does not enter his creation. I can bring you one. I have one right now. Okay, I'm waiting. We're still so, waiting after 50 minutes. So Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala, he says, yeah. Um, Chapter yeah, number and I Oh my gosh. Psych, oh you, you. You really know that you're such a liar. Wait, reference, please. Reference. Go, no speech please. reference please no no, no, no yeah. speech no speech christian christian bullies you guys are hypocrites you know why because show me your okay, okay. you are okay you are okay. Okay. okay 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 he, ca he, ca he came to uh, to call us bullies while we're asking for 15 minutes to give us one reference your side of the computer because they're seeing things that are not there. Exactly. He's adding to the eye of Allah. Right now. <laughs> That's what he yeah. that is what he's doing. I understand, guys. I'm trying to understand your position. We're who, asking you for an ayah. Okay, let listen, okay. Uh, okay, give. Give the answer. Give me the evidence from the Quran where it clearly says so we can benefit from it. Where it clearly says Allah does not enter his creation. I'm waiting. Does it say it or not? In explicitly. He ran and said. I mean, Islam, the beauty of Islam, it's, it's a very logical, very rational religion compared to faith. That's the difference. You can't, you can't, you know, put it down, mate. That's the that's that, that's the cool principle. Mate, that's the core. You, oh, are you are are you, now, are you going to cry and give a speech or are you going I'm to answer? Really okay, answer. Her, okay, okay. I, I have given you. What have you? What have you given? What have you given? What have you given? What have you given? You also a verse, mate. So Where? don't be a woman. Where? Don't play Where? with you know yeah. gotta game emotional statement. I would, you know I don't, I don't deal with that. Let's be rushed. James. Okay. James. One eye, please. Am... One eye, no speech. All right. Can I explain? Waiting. Yeah. How much time you need? Can Allah Azza wa Jalla be Can Allah Azza wa Jalla be Can Allah exist eternally and nothing Aya. else exists? Aya, please. He begets is... not nor is because. No, no. Apart, no, apart of this, this is from al 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 al. Um, the first ayah. I said clearly, which is what is the ayah number and chapter number? Number Surat Ashura, verse eleven. Okay, what what chapter number is it? Just one minute. Uh, chapter forty-two. Okay, forty-two, and then ayah number is eleven. <coughs> okay, just a second. 
I mean, you can't debunk it. It's, okay. it's a okay, very rational, read. Okay, let's read. perfect sense. Okay, wait, Logically, wait, wait, you know, from, wait, from, from, wait, from, wait, from, from wait, point of view, from wait, point of view. wait, wait, let me read it. Relax, Dude, man. Okay, I'm, let me read it, guys. Chapter 42, Ayah 11. He, he is creator of the heavens and the earth. He has made for you from yourselves mates and among the cattle mates he multiplies you thereby there is nothing like unto him and he's the hearing the seek where does this ayah guys you have listened to no me way. reading it where does it say allah does not enter his creation no way. in the meantime no we're still thank you so, thank you where so what, it does what, not say i mean i i understand because you people you are blinded you are completely brainwashed by incarnation okay Every oh. single okay, okay, okay 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 we are through incarnation that's the problem we must okay we we are blind we are worst of christians we are creators we christians we are the worst we are no, legis you guys are not, you guys are not. You according guys are to great people man. yeah according to no, the no, quran no. according to allah so is no. allah a liar is allah a liar when he said it no we muslims have to admire the christians and the jews man okay it's but in the quran yeah the quran, we have to uh, does the quran does our does the quran does the quran says we are worst of cre uh, creatures yes or no yes okay so you are basically calling Allah a liar and your prophet too right and how did you get, get to this conclusion because the Quran calls us worst of creatures the Jews and the Christians okay so so stop calling Allah a liar thank you thank you very much Bro Bro um, Rob Christian, why do you want to clear cut a verse in the Quran? Because you, because you, because you, because you made the claim, me, you need to back it up. Dude, you've still like everyone. Okay. Let me finish. The why problem is, to... listen, listen. The, here's the why. Here's the why. Okay, here's the why. Here's the why. Here's the why. You make a claim. We ask you for clear evidence. You cannot provide the evidence, and then you are crying why we are asking you. To back up your claim we are trying to understand your claim by asking you to give us clear evidence from your Quran that Allah does not enter his creation it's already 20 minutes past and no Muslim we have four Muslims in chat that cannot provide the evidence that means Islam the Quran of Allah does not back up the claims of the Muslims for 1400 years now it's 2019 and you cannot <laughs> provide us the evidence people in the text people in the chat are laughing why is that ask yourselves that Muslims I mean if, if, I mean if, even if they right, laugh right, it's, you know, it, it's not gonna harm me Can okay, please but, but but Go you on. don't see the problem you don't see the problem here <laughs> no, brother Rob, brother Rob. So, um, you guys want to. Achi, 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 listen, listen. You're calling me brother. <laughs> you're asking, you're calling me, you're calling me brother. I'm not your brother. According to the Quran, I'm not your brother. I'm the worst of creatures. Right. So, right. Uh, stop calling Allah and Muhammad liar. <laughs> Shame on you right. to go against Allah. <laughs> All right, worst of okay, creature, bro. Rob. Wait, wait. Worst. Are you are you now laughing at yourself and Allah and Muhammad? That's no, great. No, no. Man. No, no. That's great. Well, look, look, during look. during Ramadan, you are mocking Allah Himself. That's no, beautiful. You did okay. I okay. I basically provided evidence. Yeah. You, no, 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 no. Listen, listen, listen. No, listen, you, listen, 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 listen. Every Christian here believes that Allah is the devil and Muhammad <laughs> is the messenger of the devil. He's the prophet mm -hmm. of the devil. So. Uh, Correct. So we are allowed to mock the devil. We are allowed to call Muhammad a fake prophet because we yeah. can make the conclusion that Muhammad created Islam to deceive Muslims for the last 1400 years. He didn't give you any answer. You cannot back up any claim that you can make. We are asking you one ayah. Give us one clear ayah where it says Allah does not enter his creation. For the last 22 minutes, you could not back up your claim that's embarrassing that's damaging and why are you a muslim making claims about your own quran while you cannot back it up it's shameful it's embarrassing and everyone is laughing thank you for wasting our time thank you for wasting your own time and you're clearly showing us every christian here that you muslims 
have no clue what you're talking about. You make claims left and right, but at the same time, you cannot back it up. What a shameful, false religion you follow. Leave Islam, leave Islam, come back to Christ. as gods besides me why did you tell them that that's the only thing it says in corona about 20 no, it's not. and about no, god going not. to creation yeah it does man no it doesn't there's many verses that's just one verse well, you just you taking see one verse said, out of context you, you see has got another quran man i need to read the quran the shias to help the saying then i'm not shia. shia i'm not shia shia kafir oh never mind you <laughs> I mean, are, are, are we I'm done Sunni. now? So we have guys, no. guys. We have two Sunni. We have two Sunni right. Muslim brothers. One says Allah can enter His creation. The other Muslim says Allah cannot enter His creation. So which one is correct? Does Allah mm. enter His creation or does Allah not enter His creation? He can. This alter. is why Muslims are killing each other. They're all kufar. Where's that? And also, and also, <laughs> and also, they have. Um, we have a problem provide. here, guys. We have a problem here. <laughs> hey, Rob, Rob, uh, we have, we Rob, have, we have, a, we have a big disaster. We have two Muslims who claim Even, to be Sunni, yeah. and both disagree with one another. One says Allah does not enter His creation, and the other Sunni says Allah does enter His creation. Is so? No, no, which is Rob. correct? Which is correct? Well, well, be fair, Rob. Right, we have even Christians. in the hadith, we, we don't agree as well. So, just give them some credit because you know they, they have to support and back up what they believe, yeah. And, and we want to eye us, right? Do, yeah, right. If, if they can't can, do that, can then it's upon them, right? I can show you, I can show you because in the hadith, it says Allah went to another form. So, how can can you show me the hadith, brother? Brother, can you show me the hadith? Yes, I just had a yeah, yeah, of course. Okay, man. you post it in the chat in a general chat, please. Thank you. Right. Um, right. Why? Why are you looking for that? Let's let's see if we can yeah. get some. Yeah. Yeah. Maybe. Akbar! Maybe. Allah Akbar! <laughs> <laughs> Allah Akbar! Okay. Let us let us read the hadith. Please post the hadith, and you want to read it. And when 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 we can read the hadith, I'm going to provide the hadith. That will shock everyone here in the in the room. Okay, go on. No, you go. You go first, please. No, well, I, I'm not the one. Okay, who 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 said that he'll post the hadith? Okay, the other you know brother did. Okay. Okay. Can you give us the hadith, please? We're waiting. Yes, yes. I'm, I'm trying to find it, but these Muslims, they have hidden this hadith because okay. they don't want this hadith okay. to be out. So you are, to, uh, you are having you are having issue to show us, right? That's okay. Let me help you. Let me help you. Okay. How Abu Sabr. Okay. Let me let no no wait wait guys just just let us finish this topic. Joshua, sorry, I'm not trying to interrupt you, bro. No worries. Okay. I'm just okay. saying. If, okay. Let's, here's the let's hadith. Be in yeah. Here's the hadith. This. Uh, Here's the hadith that they will destroy. Here's the hadith that will destroy any claim that Allah does not enter his creation. Let me repeat it again. We are going to show you from Sahih al-Bukhari, from Sahih muslim where, where it destroys that Allah does not enter his creation. Read with me. This is from Sahih al-Bukhari, Sahih muslim No, no, wait, wait, wait. Just wait. Here's the hadith. This is Islam. Q&A.info. This is a Salafi, official Salafi uh, website. Let me give you the reference too. And we can also go to sunnah.com. Look what it says. From Sahih al-Bukhari, hadith number 1145, and Sahih Muslim, hadith number 1261. Read with me. From Abu Huraira, may Allah be pleased with him, that the Prophet said, the Lord descends, so Allah descends every night to the lowest heaven. What, what does that mean? According to the, both Sahih al-Bukhari, Sahih Muslim, it clearly says Allah enters his creation because every night 
he descends to the lowest heaven. So why mm. Muslims, why Muslims have lied to themselves for the last 1400 years and try to deceive us too by saying Allah does not enter his creation. Bam. So thank brother, thank brother, you very uh, brother, much. Can I, can I quote something? Can thank I quote you, something? <laughs> thank you very much. Uh, uh, yes, brother, can I quote something? This for uh, Bear, uh, Bell Air VI. All right, he said Allah can't go into creation. But if he can't, that means he's limited. But I got the hadith right now. Okay, but, but wait, but Muhammad, Muhammad Sword, Muhammad Sword. This yes. hadith, the hadith that I posted, and our sister Tippy Bear in the chat also gave us the hadith from sunnah.com official islamic website the mm. sunnah.com it says again abu Huraira reported allah's messenger this is sahih muslim mm. saying our lord the blessed and the exalted descends every night to the lowest heaven Do you, did you catch it i'm not um, aware of that hadith okay but the, the earth is, is so, not a okay. heaven though. what the earth is not a heaven no, 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 it says, it's no, 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 yeah, which is not, which is, which is heaven, which is heaven number one, because you have, you, you Muslims believe there are seven heavens, right? This is the lowest heaven, this is not heaven number one, you have heaven number two, three, right? So, Allah, in heaven right now, then, sorry, are we in heaven right now? You're not, you're not focusing, mm -hmm. focus, focus, focus. No, I am focused. No, you're not. No, 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 you're not. I'm no, you're aware not. of that hadith, okay, and that, that, that is not the meaning of the hadith. No, it, it that okay, is the you're, meaning. You're basically, no, no, because you're giving your... Wait, 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 wait. It clearly says, Allah enter the lowest heaven. He descends to the lowest heaven every night, every night, every night. Every night yes. he enters the, his creation because the, the heaven is the creation of Allah. Allah created heaven. Allah created earth. Here the hadith from both Sahih al-Bukhari from Sahih al-Muslim clearly says Allah descends to the lowest heaven. The heaven is the creation of Allah and Allah enters it. Yeah, let him, let him so we destroyed, we destroyed your claim Abu Sabr. We destroyed the claim of Bar Levi, but we have to agree with Muhammad Sword, the one who said Allah does enter his creation, because he was right. Can I, can I please quote something? Yes. So um, this is Sahih Al Bukhari, um, one, page ten twenty one, number seven four three seven. So Sahih Bukhari. Po post it in general, please. Post it in general. All right. It says here. Um, post it. Post it, please. Okay, no, no. Post it. No, no. We All want right. to read. We want to read with you. All right. Okay. I'm posting it because it's really important. So it says. Uh, Can you give me the link, please? Can you give me the link from uh, Sunnah.com or something? Don't don't give me a screenshot, please. Yeah, dude. Where is this? <laughs> All right. Give me a second. Sunnah.com, please, because that's an official one. Right? Wait, let me write this first down. Sahih Bukhari page. Blah, blah, blah. Yeah, but then furthermore, okay. you did not actually meet your actual condition because the hadith, once again, and an eye of the Quran, okay, they are not the same thing. Okay, they had two separate things. Okay, so. So wait, wait. How, so, wait so how are you a Muslim? Quran? Are you are you a Muslim without the Sunnah? Muslim. Are you a Sunni Muslim without the Sunnah of your Prophet? Listen. They no, said, no, no, answer, answer, please sunnah. answer, answer. No, no. Okay, no. I, I so, okay, so, so you follow, so, so you okay. follow Sahih al Bukhari, which is the second most important source after the Quran, right? Look, okay. No, no, right? Okay. Right? Yes or no? Wait, so, wait, so, you, wait, so you, you can ask me questions, but then I. I yeah, but I'll answer ask the question, you. man. I, you say I'm Sunni. Okay, okay great. So I, I you have really to follow also the, the sunnah. sunnah. Okay, great. Okay. So you have to accept the hadith. Firstly, okay, the condition you put on myself and and on my other brother was give an ayah of the Quran. And you failed. You jumped, For 20 minutes, no, you, you failed. Look, uh, can I provided evidence. No, you didn't. It, it, no, okay. you didn't. You didn't. No, you, you disagreed with Stop it. Stop lying. You didn't. Everyone okay. was laughing. Jumped, Everyone was no. waiting. I don't care whether people laugh or not. I don't care okay. about someone. Listen, I don't care about someone 
who cannot provide evidence. I can say I'm Spider-Man. I can say I'm Superman. I can say I'm Batman. But if I can't provide evidence to back up my claim, that means you are a joke and you became the joke of this server, man. Shame on you. Stop lying. You cannot provide what you say. You cannot back up what you say. Thank you. Yep. And thank you enough. Yesterday was yeah, and uh, you know he left the server. I, I didn't, he was arguing and he just left. Uh, I don't know. Yeah. I, I didn't get a response. So, so here we have a shape shifting Allah. According to that hadith, we have a shape shifting Allah who changes from from one form to another because the Muslims do not recognize him and they say to him, "We seek refuge from you." So he they are calling Allah in the hadith, Sahih hadith, by the way. He, they are calling him Satan because they say to him, "We." Uh, we seek refuge from you. Then Allah sh shapeshifts in another form and then they will recognize him. So they are actually seeing him. That means Allah is physical. But Allah at the same time, he's not a spirit according to Islam. So Allah is a physical being who can shapeshift from one form to another. He's a physical being so he can enter uh, his creation and according to Sahih al-Bukhari and Sahih Muslim, he enters the lowest heaven which is the creation of Allah every night. So why Muslims lie to themselves? Why are they trying to lie to us for the last 1400 years that Allah cannot enter his creation? Which is false and has been refuted today. Right? So Muslims accept, deal with it, that Allah actually does enter his creation every night. You cannot refute it. Not my problem, but at least stop lying because we will spank you and we will spank any sheikh who lies and deceives his Muslim followers. And we believe, we believe, like I said earlier, Islam is created by a fake prophet who collected all the stories from around him. He got stories from Jewish legion stories. He got stories from Gnostic writings from the third century and he got from Persian stories, he got from Christian uh, legend, legend stories, from Jewish legend stories, and he put them all in the Quran and he created Islam. And we have enough proof and evidence that Islam is a fake prophet who created Islam to attack the person of Jesus Christ, the mm -hmm. Lord and Amen. Savior Amen. of everyone. And every knee will bow and Amen. will every accept, everything will yep. confess that Jesus Christ is Lord. So Amen. it's not late, Muslims. Amen. Accept Jesus Christ as your Lord and Savior before it's too late. You still have the time. Amen. Accept him. Because he is Al-Haq. He said, I am the truth. He is the Haq. He is the truth, the way, and life. Amen. Who made this claim? Which prophet in history said, I am the truth, the way, and life? He is the no life one. giver. He is the creator. Even according to the Quran, Muhammad is a creator. Sorry, even to, according to Muhammad and, and Allah, Jesus is the creator in the Quran. He gives life. He is Kalimat Allah, the word of Allah, the eternal word of Allah. He is Ruh Allah. Right? So we don't, need, we don't even need the Quran to prove to you that Jesus is Lord. But Muslims follow a desert Arab 600 years later who contradicted all the prophets. He failed miserably for all the Ten Commandments, right? If you go through all the Ten yeah. Commandments, Muhammad failed every commandment one by one. What's the first commandment, Christians? Can someone tell me what the first commandment is? Love the Lord thy God with all your heart, mind, soul, and strength. Thank you. Thank you. Did Muhammad believe in Yahweh? No. He came with a different God, Allah. Who is Allah? The Jews never heard of Allah. The Christians have never heard of Allah. So, is, so he already failed for number one. What's number two? What's the number two con uh, commandment? Uh, have no other God to worship. Ten commandments. Num number one is have no other God before me. Okay. I'm the Lord of God. Second number. Do not make yourself an image. Do not. Yeah. So Muhammad worshipped 
the black stones. He bowed down to the Kaaba and he kissed the black stone. Did Moses do that? No. Did Jesus do that? No. So uh, we already showed you from the first two commandments that Muhammad failed those two. And one of the Ten Commandments is also respect your parents, right? Respect your parents. Did Muhammad respect his parents? No. Muhammad actually called his parents Najis. He said they will burn in hellfire. One Sahabi asked Muhammad, where is your father, O Prophet? Muhammad turns and he says to the to this Sahabi, your father and my father are burning in hellfire. There is another hadith who he is asked, where is Amina? Muhammad says she's in hellfire, and he even asked Allah. She, he even asked Allah to forgive his mother. Allah didn't forgive his mother. So both the father of Muhammad and the mother of Muhammad are burning in hellfire. He called them nages. Thank you again. Muhammad is a fake prophet. Muslims come back to the real Lord Jesus Christ. There is no Isa. Even the Arabic speaking Christians don't call Jesus Isa. We call him Yesu al-Masih. Who is Isa? There is no Isa in Arabic. His name is Yesu al-Masih, which comes from the Aramaic Yeshua. Yesu, Yeshua. Who is Isa? We believe that Muhammad confused Jesus, Yeshua, with Esau, the brother of Jacob. Because if you go to the Old Testament, you can see that one of the brothers of Jacob was named Esau. And Muhammad also confused Mary, the mother of Jesus, with Miriam, the sister of Aaron, and Moses, which is a 1,500-year-old mistake, historical disaster. Oh, by the way, Abdullah Ahbar got killed for that eventually. Uh, yeah. When he exposed that, Abdullah Ahbar got killed for that specific thing. Yeah. Well, they never said that in history, but they actually just uh, said they people. Yeah, and you know, Muhammad had no idea who the real Jesus was. He had no clue, and the Quran is clear proof for that. He had no clue who Jesus was. He even made another mistake. He called... The father of Abraham, Azar. Azar in Aramaic is a insult. It means fool. The real father of Abraham, according to the Old Testament, is called Terah, right? Terah. So who is Azar? Azar in Aramaic means fool. And if we go and study that ayah in the Quran, we understand that Abraham is calling his father fool because he was an idol worshiper. So Muhammad thought, that the real name of the father of Abraham is Azar, but that's not true. It's an insult. That's from, that's from the Targum. That's from the Targum. Uh, yes, exactly. So Muhammad had no clue. He was hearing false stories from the Jews who were trolling Muhammad. For example, another example, the punishment of the grave. The punishment of a grave is a false statement because if you go to the Hadith, Two Jewish women come to Aisha. They visit Aisha. And they said to Aisha, Hey Aisha, have you heard of the punishment of the grave? They knew because every time they told something to Muhammad and his family, Muhammad adopted the lie, the trolling of the Jews into Islam. So look what happened. The two Jewish ladies come to Aisha and they ask her, Have you heard of the punishment of the grave? Aisha said, no, you are lying. So Aisha immediately knew these two women are trolling me. They are lying to me. So she, she said to them, Aisha said, you are lying. So when do, those two Jewish women went away, Aisha went to Muhammad, the prophet of Islam. She asked her, two Jewish uh, women came to me and they mentioned something called the punishment of the grave. I didn't believe them. But Muhammad the fool he was, he said, yes, yes, this is true. And he adopted the punishment on, of the grave in Islam. And still, till today, Muslims believe in the punishment of the grave. Well, it was a nothing but a lie. Jews don't believe in that. It was simply trolling them.
And by the way, that kind of uh, backfired on him later on because he was trying to do the opposite later on, not copy them. And when he tried to do that with the funeral procession, uh, when the Jew basically came to him and said, hey, look, we do the same thing. We stand in funeral. He said, sit down, sit down. And he was trying to basically do the opposite of what he did. Before, yes, yes. Because he got caught, caught out so many times. Doing yeah, and Ephraim, we know why that, that was right. Because when Muhammad went to Medina, he tried to reconcile, reconcile with the Jews, right? He wanted to tell them, hey, look, I'm a prophet, please accept me. When he found out that they did reject him and he became powerful, he started to expel them. So this is why you That's see in the beginning, this is why you see in the beginning that Muhammad basically adopted what they were telling him. They, they He was trying to reconcile with them. So this is why Muhammad yeah, sure. in the beginning is adopting everything the Jews did. But then when they rejected him and he became powerful enough, he expelled them. He turned 180 degrees the other way and he started to reject their traditions, right? And the one that you mentioned. Yes, um, and by the way, uh, people don't understand what poet is in Arabian culture the poet is basically a satirist he's a he's a comedian they write they were writing about yes him. yes they were writing about him it's, it's basically a, it's, it's a stand-up comedy if you think about it in our terms today yeah uh, the Jews were basically trolling him, essentially they were trapping him at every bit that whole uh, chapter 18 is a joke about him essentially yeah. it was a trap for him to fall in and he fell head in and that's essentially that one body that's what but all the Jews killed in the area because they were they were mocking him because he's not yes. a prophet. Yeah, and he, he was three times in the Quran he's been accused of nothing but a poet, even a mad poet, right? He he was called Majnun, and Majnun in Arabic means someone who is possessed by jinn. The pagans called him yeah. uh yeah. Majnun, right? Possessed by jinn. You're nothing but a mad poet. The Jews were calling him nothing but a poet. And you, you clearly said it. Yeah, and I have to agree with that. Because when you're called in Arabic, when you're called poet, that means you are being rejected. You are being called comedian. Because a poet is a yes. liar. Right? He Exactly right. And that's why he, he invents to stuff. The, yeah? if one of the things that he... Uh, yeah, that's right. And, and one of the reasons why he was trying to jump off the cliff he actually gave the reason to Aisha because he wanted to, he wanted to jump because the, I don't want to be like a mad poet. That's one of the reasons he gave her. Yeah, because when uh, Waraka ibn Novel died, right, he became sad. And we know why he became sad. We actually, if we study carefully the sources, we believe that Waraka ibn Novel was the real father of Muhammad, not Abdullah, because Abdullah died and Amina was carrying Muhammad in her belly. Four years after the death of Abdullah, for four years in yeah, her belly. The lights burn. Yeah. The, light, the lights burn. It's yeah. going to us. So there's no woman who carries a baby for four years in her belly, right? <laughs> Unless it's a Terminator. Maybe a Terminator. Yeah, maybe a Terminator. Yeah. So we believe actually that Waraka ibn Nofal was the real father of Muhammad. It was an inside job, right? No one saw Jibreel, right? And even Muhammad, when he went to uh, Khadija and he said to her, cover me, cover me. I feel that jinn or demon uh, uh, touched me, right? Lamassani, a jinn, right? Yes. Exactly. He, yeah, Muhammad he, actually he, said he, it. He, Muhammad actually said it. Right. Yeah, yeah, I am touched by jinn. So Muhammad knew he was touched by jinn in that cave because the jinn was squeezing him three times and forcing him to do things that he didn't like to do. Right, he Not forced. He says, uh, "Get the mayonnaise out." Yeah, so he was squeezing them and squeezing them and squeezing them. So no angel in the history of angels, <laughs> no angel ever forced someone to do anything. And a true angel always said, "I come in peace." Right. Exactly right. Yeah. That exactly right. that demon that appeared to him in that cave Hira never said i come in peace no he, he immediately started to squeeze him that's already a sign that, that muhammad was encountered by a demon and muhammad said cover me cover me khadija jinn lamassani right i i'm touched by jinn yeah them <laughs> 
exactly so then then we have the test of Khadija you know I always say Islam is created by deception and created on basis of a striptease and a lap dance I'm not kidding you this is what the sources of Islam say That's because much what it is. yeah because Islam is created by the deception why deception because Khadija the first wife of Muhammad deceived her father she made him drunk and got married to Muhammad because her father was a noble of the Quraysh he was the richest man of Mecca right they had money yeah and they had money and Muhammad was poor money. yeah and so her father the father of Khadija didn't want to marry her his daughter to a poor guy like Muhammad so it was against his will so what did Khadija do she made her dad drunk and when her dad got a hangover the next morning and woke up saw and witnessed that they were married already so so here we have a deception <laughs> yeah here we have the deception number one number two when Muhammad went to Khadija to prove to prove that this creature is not a demon or a jinn to to make sure she asked him to sit on her lap right so Muhammad gave a lap dance to Khadija he switched from one lap to another lap and then she took off her clothes so here Islam is created on a deception of the father of Khadija Islam is created on the lap dance of Muhammad that he gave to Khadija and Khadija taking off her clothes by doing a nice striptease for Muhammad right so Khadija did not see the, uh, the so-called angel right because Muhammad said I am touched by jinn and she took him to Waraka and also Waraka didn't say this is an angel no he said this is Namus Namus in Arabic means law the law of the Old Testament the law that was given to Moses right so no one in the end guys no one saw the so-called angel Muhammad had to listen to Waraka had to listen to Khadija that this so-called creature this so-called jinn was actually the angel Gabriel which is totally false because Muhammad did not believe in the beginning that this was an angel he saw this is a demon he said it go to the early sources of Islam you can find it there specifically says that by the way yeah so yeah in the end Muslims I hope if I'm not sure if there's Muslims still listening I don't think so they all left but in the end in the end Islam is fake Islam is man-made Muhammad was possessed by jinns and I made a video about it uh, the jinn we have even the name of the jinn is called al Abiyad, the white one he was a shapeshifter like Allah <laughs> as we mentioned in the early hadith Allah can shapeshift and this jinn al abiyad the white one could shapeshift and he could make himself look like Dahiya al-Kalbi and like Who, Jibreel who's the Indian? who's the Indian? Yeah, and he was sent to India right according to Islam he's still in India the white one al abiyad this is according to Al-Qurtubi and this is according to Ibn Abbas by the way guys uh just to let you know paul specifically talks about the object in two corinthians yeah. and he says they the creature himself can appear as a white angel yes a shapeshifter so the creature that came to muhammad was nothing but a demon and muhammad was demon possessed thank you guys